Hey guys, welcome back to another live video. So as you can tell, it's another salty much. I know how much you guys like this series. So as you can tell by the title, we're going to be talking about some cards that people are salty, especially around this ban list season. So we're going to go ahead and talk about that and explain to them why they should stop being so salty. So the first card we are going to be looking at is... Dark Hole. All right, so... I've been seeing a lot of people's ban list predictions. They've pretty much been saying that Dark Hole should be banned because Heavy Storm and Monster Reborn are banned, so why not Dark Hole? Sure. Because Dark Hole's not that good in comparison to Heavy Storm and, and Monster Reborn. I mean, sure, Dark Hole can, you know, change the game state, but it's still, it's not as good. You know, the majority of the meta decks are even taking the card out of their deck. You know, especially with hands running around, you don't want to dark hole them. So. Mm, no, you don't dark hole anything. You don't. If you see a face down, you don't play dark hole. <laughs> if you face down, if you dark hole a face down, and it happens to be a hand, you're just stupid. <laughs> Depends. Is it early in the duel? Oh. If it's like first turn, if it's like first turn, and you set a monster and I go, I would dark hole you. Really? Because it would be either a hand. I don't have any monster on the field. That's true. That's Ice true. hand fire, and I don't got any spell or traps. Or it could be gear gear gear, which he doesn't get flipped. So. First turn Dark Hole, and it's not bad, but, you know, Dark Hole is one of the, you know, resource cards that you want to hold on to. In my opinion, Dark Hole is still a really great card. Uh, I would still run it, just because, you know, even if you're winning, you know, you can still just go ahead and throw the Dark Hole at him when the situation comes awry. But, you know... In, in this day and age, age it's just, it was banned back in the day. Yeah. It was banned because it was just, there wasn't a lot of monster destruction, and Dark Hole was powerful. It was... You look at Raigeki, that thing was second in line. Nowadays, Dark Hole is... It all depends on the situation. You, know? you can't just go Dark Hole and say, Haha, I just got over your monsters that take five turns to kill. No, it's... Nothing stays you know, on the field. The game's faster, the resources yeah. are better. So, And like I said, some decks aren't even running the Dark Hole. And you can, you know, like, oh, Dark Hole Bujin, and then they block with hair. Oh, Dark Hole and Madoche, and then they get all the cards back to their hand. So, you know, really depending on the deck, where what you hit with Dark Hole, you know, not may not be the best of uh, cards to play, but it's definitely not ban worthy. It's not ban worthy. It's, it's not. It's not going up to two either. If you're thinking like maybe. No, Hell not, no. 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 It's just stay okay. at one. It's fine right where it's at. Right at one. Yeah, that's, that's like, if you top deck it, you got lucky. You used it, and at least I don't have to worry about it for the rest of the damn duel. Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> Dog deck that shit on you. <laughs> I hate you. Alright, so tell me what you guys think of these people being salty and wanting Dark Hole ban. I just think that they need to play better. If you're losing to Dark Hole, there's a problem. Unless, at a sheer luck, they had full field of crap and you just said Dark Hole, bitch. Dark and neg so much. Yeah, and if you can make them neg with that, that's like Heavy Storm. People played Heavy Storm when there was like one, two cards in the field. What yeah. do you fucking do? As long as you plus. All right, yep. so next card we're looking at because people are salty is... Honest! Honestly, you want Honest Ban. Honestly, honestly. And the reason for this is because Bujins have three Crane and three Sinyo, so we should might as well just ban Honest. Yep, so let's you, punish so, the lights. Let's just punish every light player yeah. because of Bujins. No, no, no. And one of the arguments I saw is that besides Bujins having Crane is that... Light Swords have Electromagnetic Turtle. I don't even know what the hell that is. It's like, once per duel, while it's in your graveyard, you can... It's either banish it or just use it what to that end the battle phase. I don't know. I don't know. All I know is that all of a sudden, it's kind of going up because, you know, people run run it in Shadal so they can go ahead and, you know, shoot, fuse into Nephilim and then block with... Uh, with the electromagnetic turtle. I'd rather super poly than waste that. Okay, sure. I, I, I don't. I've never even heard. What I mean, I've never even heard of this card. But that's the reason why Ana should go. Like that crane and the electromagnetic turtle are newer cards that Konami wants to sell, and Honest isn't selling, so they should just ban Honest. Is it? Did it come out, or is it already out? What electromagnetic turtle? Yeah, I think so. What's set? I don't know. What the? It's not. It's not a big enough popular card for me to freaking watch. I don't even think it was that important to even care if I don't even know what the hell it is. I exactly. go through this game for a lot of stuff. But no, for reals. Honest is not ban worthy. I mean, hell, OCG has three of them. Two. It's two? Two. I thought it was three. Two. I'm thinking Rescue Rabbit. Yep. Yeah. Two. They have two on us. That's still... That's, that's still too many honest. That's a lot of honest. Yeah. That's just a lot of honest. I... I, I, I wouldn't even want to attack if knowing my opponent had two fucking honest. I wouldn't even. Nope. 
I find Honest another is, way. Honest is find out one where if they get you with it, then, oh, that's cute. Uh, I guess I ran into that, you know. But at two and three, no. But he's not banned, is he? No, it's not. But, like... So we can just get off, uh, get off that, guys. Right. Yeah, if you're, you're losing lose. to Honest, you're yeah. either overextending or not knowing Bujins, how to play. They want to punish Bujins. <laughs> yeah, punish the Bujins. Punish Crane, punish the Turtle, because Turtle spells speed three. Remember that. What? It's a because it, it, it could be activated in damage step. They they declared when Fire and Ice Hand were doing shit, they said Turtle can block Fire and Ice Hand. I wouldn't call it spell speed three. I mean, it can activate during damage step, but not spell speed three. That's a spell speed three type. Only spell speed threes can activate in damage step. Um, or damage yeah, step or damage calc. It can. Well, the thing is, it, it's not damage step. It's damage calc. You know, when when say fire and ice yeah. hand are going off, it can block that. Yeah, I mean that's, I got that. But that's I, a spell well, speed three type, tight. but it's it's just it's a spell speed three monster in its own little it functioning. Can't versus a spell speed three card, you know. No, it's it, it can't. But I mean, I'm just saying, it's, oh, okay. it functions so it can block like during the damage step. So that's great. Yeah, it, it, it can do some weird crap, but I don't know why they rule. I mean, come on. I, when we were at YCS, I. I, I, I yelled, I'm like, fuck yes, when they said, yeah, a turtle, by the way, permanently negates Venus Chain if it targets. Okay. Oh, yeah, because it flips it face down. Oh, no. Done. Oh, all right, Anyways, so that's off topic as hell. Yeah. <laughs> and the saltiest of all the salty cards divided out of all these three is... <laughs> Kaiser Coliseum. All right. Well, besides Bujin, who the fuck plays this card? <laughs> Right. Constellars did, Evil Swarms did, but now we don't, because no. there's no reason to. We've got room. <laughs> What's the room? We're dealing with artifacts. That crap blows crap up. Oh, yeah. What's the point? So, waste, waste. Yeah, that card's just great right now. They're pretty much they're like, oh, you can't play Yu-Gi-Oh! What do you mean you can't play Just fight me one-on-one. -on -one. So, it's so wrong to fight me one-on-one. -on -one. It's not. I'm already negging by playing the card, so... Kaiser Coliseum isn't that... Bad. It's it's a good card. Don't get me wrong, but the problem with it is, is it can be played around if you know what you're doing. If you know it just it put you in a submission, great. You have to wait on what your opponent's gonna do. If they decide to play that extra monster and it gives you a chance to open up and say fuck you, then do it. But you have to play around and use the card back at them. You can. That's a that's a turning point that you can sit there and sit on resources and build resources if necessary. It's not a, it's not a broken card. If you're losing to this and you don't know what to do with it, do a little bit more research on your deck. Yeah. Simple as that. You you can't expect to be like, I play Kaiser Coliseum. Well, there goes my deck. Well, what, what are you not playing anything to blow it up with? Not waiting for opportunities to get around it? I mean, yeah. are you not playing back row? Is that the point? Am I not seeing breakthrough skills, Phoenix chains, deep prisons to hold that motherfucker down? That, really? Yeah, that would work. You know, they play a monster, one monster, you, they try to do something, you feed his chain, oh. you know, they pretty much have to go into another monster that opens up another slide. They're probably losing this against us in Nets. Noble Knights. Noble Knights. Uh, sure, All yeah. Right. If that's a fix for Noble Knights, then don't worry about that deck, because that deck is just... That deck's dying off next format. Don't worry it about is. it. Don't worry about it. Sell your Medrots now. <laughs> for the love of God. Sell them while they're 40. They will drop. Yeah. That's expected. Noble Knights have not done a thing, never do a thing. Maybe they done one thing here and there. But they're just rogue as hell and they're just dumb. They're just dumb. I mean, right. hell, Constellars do better than they do. Constellars are derp derp. Same with Ophion. <laughs> Ophion derp. So is there anything else you want to say? Kaiser Coliseum? <laughs> Honest. Darkhold. Not ban worthy. If you think these are ban worthy, rethink your brain. Damn. I know that's exactly how I feel. Rethink your entire brain. Brainception. Do it. Yup. I know I am being a dick right now, but this, this, <laughs> this, no, <laughs> this. Mmm. Sell your cards now. <laughs> I can't be too cold. <laughs> too strong. <laughs> That's like saying, listen. I had to equip my Utopia with the with the Tiger Club. I don't, I don't know the name. Ti Thunder, Ban it. Tornado. Fucking. Why is that in there? Cause they want something banned. Here, ban Jackpot Seven. It doesn't. It's never gonna. It's not gonna get any worse than what these do now. So. Yeah. That's my point. Done. Yeah. I'm dead. I'm right. done. Let's not ban it. Let's just put it to two. <laughs> That's so dick. <laughs>
<laughs> Why even bother? <laughs> Uh, uh, well, I hope you guys good. enjoyed this uh, live video. So thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for all the support. And I will see you guys next time with another live video. Thanks for watching.